Hi, I'm back. Bill Jordan here. I'm at 201-790-3368. I want to thank you for coming in, you know, saying hi to us, you know, because it's very important. I, I really appreciate it. And, uh, you know, I'm looking forward to engage with you, you know, uh, your story, and put it out there. But uh, if you're a painter, sculptor, or a candlestick maker, this is where you need to be. People buy from people they know, and the best way for them to know you is with my candid video interviews. In the sense of knowing, it's like, you know, knowing you, they, they care for you, they love you, and they'll help you. That's what you want. That's what the candid video interview does. You know, and also for those guys who are concerned about leading something for posterity, that's what it does too, okay? So now, we're talking about the five elements that you have to consider when you're talking about your story, right? Reading from this book right here, I'm trans transliterating the, what he says for the artist. This is by Gary Gagliardi, all right? All right, five elements, five factors determine your success in a, in the, as a storyteller, as an artist, all right? Because that's what you are. <clears throat> you're a storyteller. <clears throat> Excuse me. You're a story, you're a visual storyteller, all right? And you weigh these, weigh these factors, you know, when, when you're looking at your story, when you're evaluating your story, when you're analyzing your story, all right? All right. All right. You, must, you must know, you know, what is, this, what, is, what is your story fit in in the overall gestalt of the, of the lay of the land, okay? And, and, and you have to know the, the mission of your work. The mission of your work is what? What's your mission? Now, you're going to say, you know, I'm not saying you, because I know already you know I wouldn't, I wouldn't expect you to say this. But a lot of people think that the mission of their work is to make beautiful things. Well, that's a very low-level mission, because beauty is only skin deep, right? Right? We over here are saying the purpose is to raise the human consciousness. Whatever you do, that's the main thing. And that's possible no matter what, what like you say, uh, what trend or segment you're in. Let's say you're in a landscape segment, right? You're, you're doing, you know, your segment as a landscaper. You can still raise the human consciousness <clears throat> based upon the condition that you that you compose it correctly, that you intentionally have a meaning that broadcasts 24 seven from that piece, okay? And your, and your segment as a, as a landscape painter. Now, the trends also have to be observed. And the trends meaning like a landscape's now going to be what? You know, um, representational? A landscape's gonna be abstract? A landscape's gonna be, you know, impressionistic? What is the trend? Where do you, you know, and, and how, do, how do the trends impact what your, your job? Because basically, at the, in this playing field now, the trends, although exist, there's, a, there's someone, there's a place for everybody. You see, none like, unlike in the days of, let's say, you know, the Renaissance days when, you know, mo most, a lot of works were, were commissioned by the church to do religious pieces, right? It was an off painting, let's say, that, you know, well, I don't know, but I, it could be that way. But I'm just saying, it may be, there were, there were a few paintings. There were more religious paintings than not. That's what I'm trying to say, because that was the, the trend, okay? So now the next, you know, next is your market leadership. That's your, your craftspersonship, your, your uh, art, art, artistry. Is it, is it good, man? What, is, what does that mean to be a, a leader as an artist? You have to have knowledge. You have to be honest, service-oriented, courage, and be disciplined. All right? You have to have those things, man. You got one, two, the five factors you have to have. Right? It means you have to have the courage, the discipline. Let's talk about courage. Call me up. 201-790-3368. I'm going to go back in the next clip and talk about leadership with respect to those five elements. Join me then in the next one, 201-790-3368. I'm going to call it artistic leadership, all right? Peace out.